traveler and explorer from India and welcome to my travel channel. So right now I'm sitting by the side of Ganga River. It's so peaceful. So I just witnessed a beautiful sunset. Can you guess the place where I am right now? If you guessed it right, I am at Rishikesh in Uttarakhand. Rishikesh which is a place close to Haridwar so it is known as a pilgrimage town and is considered to be one of the holiest places for the Hindus so there are a number of temples and yoga ashramas in Rishikesh they are practicing yoga and meditation so if you do not know Rishikesh is also the beginning point of the famous Chardham Yatra of the Hindus the Chardham includes Gangotri, Yamunotri, Kedarnath and Badrinath and in this video I am going to tell you top 10 things to do while in Rishikesh but before we start my video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon for further notifications. Before I tell you the top 10 things to do in Rishikesh, let me share with you something really important. You know, as a traveler, especially as a woman traveler, hygiene is very important and you need to maintain some kind of cleanliness and be safe. So I recently came across a very good brand. The name of the brand is Be Safe. They make really good intimate and hygiene products like female hygiene products. If you take it, sanitary napkins or tampons or menstrual cups everything like that or even intimate wash intimate wipes as well as toilet disinfectant surface disinfectant so you should definitely check them out considering all the damage we have done to our planet we all are trying to move to sustainable living so it's a request to every ladies if we can move from pads or tampons to menstrual cups it's really a part of sustainable living so this one here this is an intimate wash for women you should definitely start using this one this one is intimate wipes so this is a great product for my traveling at least and the third one is menstrual cup and i recently started using menstrual cup of pisa and as a woman traveler i'm all the time traveling and especially traveling to a place like rishikesh which is known for adventure activities you need to maintain proper hygiene and enjoy traveling the most important question always comes how to reach rishikesh rishikesh is very close to haridwar around 45 minutes or one hour it is very close to dehradun as well around one hour one and a half hour and from delhi to Rishikesh it takes around five to six hours drive so you can do self drive or you can take public transport as well there is an airport which is Jolly Grant Airport which is also called Dehradun Airport but it is in between Rishikesh and Dehradun so it's very close to Rishikesh you can take that one as well so Rishikesh is not only a holy place it is also famous for adventure activities especially rafting people do come here and enjoy great rafting in river Ganga it is also famous for bungee jumping zip line paragliding etc so if you're not that adventurous Take a holy dip in Ganga river and enjoy your moment. There are lot of stay options in Rishikesh and especially being a holy place as well as a place known for rafting, the ashrams, guest houses, yoga centers, hostels, camps also provide budget stays. The most popular places to stay are the adjoining areas of Lakshman Jhula. If you wish to stay a little far from the crowd and in a peaceful place, you can check out Shantivan Inn where we stayed and had a great time. And if you choose to stay around Shivpuri area, Mysa Resort is definitely a good stay option. So the top 10 things to do in Rishikesh in my experience. So the number one, Lakshman Jula, that is the center point of Rishikesh. So there are many temples, guest houses, ashrams, cafes, shopping options. There are a lot of activities going on around the Lakshman Jula area. It is not really a jula, it is actually a bridge. But because of the vibration of the swinging, it is often called as Lakshman Jula. Number two, 
होली दीप इन गंगा रिवर गंगा इज नॉट ओनली अ रिवर इट इज आर मदर वी हिंदूज वी वॉशिप इट बट इवन इफ यू बिलोंग टू एनी अदर रिलीजन और एनी अदर कंट्री यू वुड डेफिनेटली हैव अ गुड टाइम इन ऋषिकेश गंगा हियर इज रियली पीसफुल देर इज सो मच स्पिरिचुअलिटी अराउंड देर इज सो मच कामनेस देर इज सो मच सेरिनिटी एंड सो मच ब्यूटी ऑल अराउंड दैट यू वोट बी एबल टू रेजिस्ट योर सेल्फ फ्रॉम गोइंग टू द गंगा रिवर एंड टेक द होली डे नंबर थ्री राम झूला एंड नियर बाई प्लेसेस सो यू शुड डेफिनेटली क्रॉस राम झूला ऑन फुट और यू कैन वॉक डाउन फ्रॉम राम झूला टू लक्ष्मण झूला सो देर आर मल्टीपल घाट्स एंड देर आर टेम्पल्स अराउंड द राम झूला एरिया ऑल्सो देर आर लॉट ऑफ शॉपिंग ऑप्शन अराउंड द राम झूला एंड लक्ष्मण झूला एरिया एज वेल एंड देर इज अ फेमस रेस्टोरेंट इट्स नेम इज चोटी वाला यू शुड डेफिनेटली ट्राई आउट फूड इन चोटी वाला एज वेल देर इज अ प्लेस कॉल्ड मुनी की रेती एंड यू कैन सी द डिफरेंट योगा आश्रम्स एंड मेडिटेशन सेंटर्स नंबर फोर यू शुड डेफिनेटली एन्जॉय द रिवर साइड कैफे एक्सपीरियंस एंड ट्राई आउट द वंडरफुल फूड एंड माई रिकमेंडेशन वुड बी टू ट्राई आउट इजराइली फूड फॉर श्योर यू डोंट गेट नॉन वेजिटेरियन फूड इन ऋषिकेश एंड अ नॉन वेजिटेरियन पर्सन लाइक मी हैड अ ग्रेट टाइम एन्जॉइंग ऑल द गुड फूड इन ऋषिकेश एंड इफ आई हैव टू टेक द नेम्स ऑफ फ्यू कैफे इट वुड बी गंगा व्यू कैफे गंगा बीच कैफे रॉयल कैफे लिटिल बुद्धा कैफे बीटल्स कैफे देर आर लॉट ऑफ अदर ऑप्शन एंड आई एम ऑलवेज हैप्पी विद द फूड इज गुड एंड यू गेट द बेस्ट फ्रेश जूस इन ऋषिकेश आई गेस सो नंबर फाइव इज राजा जी नेशनल पार्क सो इट हैज़ वन एंट्रेंस फ्रॉम ऋषिकेश यू कैन डेफिनेटली प्लान टू ड्राइव थ्रू राजा जी नेशनल पार्क एंड यू कैन बुक योर सफारी एज वेल इफ यू आर अ फॉरेस्ट एंड जंगल पर्सन बाई द वे देर आर जंगल रिजॉर्ट ऑल्सो वेर यू कैन चूज टू स्टे इट्स वेरी नियर बाई टू ऋषिकेश एंड अ परफेक्ट एक्सपीरियंस पॉइंट नंबर सिक्स बीटल्स आश्रम द फेमस इंग्लिश रॉक बैंड Beatles they visited Rishikesh do you know that so there is a ashram which is very close to Ram Jhula and opposite to Muni ki Reti you should definitely check out that place point number 7 it's neel waterfall again you cannot miss going to the waterfalls whenever you are visiting any place so it gets little crowded if you are not visiting in the early morning but it should be in your itinerary if you are planning to visit Rishikesh point number 8 explore shivpuri in rishikesh where majority of the campsites are there and majority of the rafting starts from shivpuri only there are few white sand beaches which are really interesting in rishikesh and also if you are looking for non vegetarian food or alcohol you do get it in shivpuri point number 9 camping and rafting in rishikesh this is the most important point i don't know why i have kept as the point number 8 but whenever you are visiting rishikesh you would feel the vibe and energy all the enthusiastic people going for rafting and they are so happy they are so excited about it and in the ganga river also you will find a lot of rafts and people doing rafting and following the rafting a must stay in the campsites where all the people you made friends with they would be together in the same camp be cherishing and hoo hoo about your adventure activity and the 10th point is experiencing the maha aarti in triveni ghat it is a very religious and holy place you should definitely visit the place in the morning or in the evening time to check out the aarti and experience the same thank you Now comes the most important part, sharing with you all the itinerary and the budget. And here I am sharing with you four days, three nights itinerary for a short Rishikesh trip. 
So this is the budget breakup for the itinerary that we shared. For a couple, you can spend around 10 to 15,000 roughly for a return trip from Dehradun. Finally, to the end of this video, I'm really happy that I visited Rishikesh. It calmed me down and I'm feeling so, so good. Finally, we have come to the end of this video. Guys, please share your suggestions as well. The best things to do in Rishikesh in the comment section below. We would love to know that. I am definitely coming back to Rishikesh and let me know if you are planning to do the same. Rishikesh is not only for the religious people but it is for everyone. There are yoga camps and ashramas where you can do meditation and practice yoga. So it is for everyone, for us, for the senior citizens and for younger people as well. And in Rishikesh there is beautiful Ganga river, there is Rajaji national park, there are mountains. So nature has lot to offer in Rishikesh as well as there are adventure activities like camping, rafting, bungee jumping. So it's a place for all. So you should definitely plan to visit Rishikesh if you have not visited already. And that's it. That's the end of my video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon for further notifications.